We are about to eat these tortellini with spinach for dinner and then I'll get back to the grocery haul. Here we are. Hi guys, this is my grocery haul for this week. Mine is the bits that I just ate for tea. I've got some interesting recipes to try this week. I'm quite excited. So let me show you what I've got. I've got two bunches of bananas and a pineapple. I was wrong about the pineapple last week. It wasn't hard or not right. It tasted good. So I got another one of those. And then I have got a cucumber. That's to go with some hummus. And I've got the avocados. We've been having those for lunches. Some eggs. Coriander. I'm going to do the um, crab linguine. I've already got a can of crab in the cupboard. And then with that, I also put tomatoes. And I've got some limes left from last week as well. I bought some linguine to go with it. Oh, that bag of linguine is open at the end. That might have just happened when I put some stuff on top of it. And I got a bag of carrots. I wish they did carrots in smaller bags. They don't sell stuff individually at Ocado, but I, we never really get to all of the carrots. They just sell so many of them. We really only want about four carrots. The carrots are quite cheap, but still, doesn't mean you have to have loads of them. Um, Boomba, this is the uh, tomato puree that I really like. It's not got that kind of acidic, taste to it that a lot of purees have so we use that a lot on pizzas and we're going to be having pizzas this week I haven't eaten the rice cakes that I bought last week but these are still on offer so I got another packet of them for the cupboard and some figs this is going to go with the shallots which are just behind it there on a toast recipe and you roast the shallots with garlic and mix the roasted garlic with the ricotta and spread it onto the toast. I found this big stack of recipes that I'd torn out of magazines. I've been having a good go through all of my drawers and clearing things out and I've never got around to making any of the recipes but I'd saved them from different magazines so I think this one was from the Waitrose magazine probably a couple of years ago. Um, I'm gonna make that so that'll be on the What We Ate video uh, probably the week after next. Week after, yeah. And then I got some Cheese, these have become our standard cheeses for crackers in the evening. I've got some crackers in here somewhere as well. Some garlic. I got this um, side of salmon. It's 850 grams. It's always on offer, this is, so you think you're getting a good deal. I, I forget what, I think it was £13 and it's reduced from 20 but it very rarely sells for 20 And they used to do one before, which was actually a kilo and that sold for £10, so that was much better. But this is still a lot, and I'll portion this out, and we'll have that for... I'm going to do some breakfast bowls, I think, with salmon for breakfast. Maybe similar to the Pret um, protein bowls that they do, because I've had that a couple of times and really enjoyed it and found it quite filling as well. So some of that spinach that we had with tea will go with that. And then I got some Cars crackers. I used to have this kefir quite often and I really enjoyed it and it was on offer um, five for five pounds so I bought ten of those. I bought mostly the just plain one because this one has got um, stuff added to it and I wanted to go for it as, as simple as possible but all that's added to it is the cacao and then this one is um, cherry so I got two of the cacao ones and two of the cherry ones where I already drank one of the cherry ones earlier and then I got milk, hummus, I do prefer to make my own hummus but as I said we're running down the stuff that's in the cupboards and I don't have any tahini and tahini is something that sits in the fridge for ages and ages and then I feel like years probably because you only use a spoonful of it here and there and it, does, it doesn't keep forever and I didn't want to buy another thing of tahini for it to sit in the fridge for ages so I just bought the Waitrose Essential Hummus, so hopefully that's nice. I think I might have had it before and I think it's okay. And then I also got grated mozzarella, which is to go on top of the pizzas. So that is everything. I forget what the other meal was. We've got the salmon there. We've plenty of salmon for the freezer, so that's good. I'm sure it'll come to me. If you watch the uh, What's For Dinner video, you'll see what we make from all of this. Oh, I forgot this big box at the back as well is filled with basil. Uh, fresh basil. Or some other recipe. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you again soon. Bye bye.